students in this video you will be learning about the definition of angular acceleration and torque and the relationship between angular acceleration and torque this topic is important for intermediate first year physics let us see the definition of angular acceleration the rate of change of angular velocity is called angular acceleration so at what rate the angular velocity is changing when the object is in circular motion at the time how angular velocity is changing with respect to time is called as angular acceleration it is very simple the rate of change of angular velocity is called as angular acceleration formula is alpha is equal to d omega by dt second definition torque the rate of change of angular momentum is called torque that means at what rate angular momentum is changing how angular momentum is changing with respect to time that is called as a torque and the formula is tau is equal to dl by dt let us see the second part of the question here we have to find the relationship between angular acceleration and torque to find the relationship between them we should know the following formulas tau is equal to dl by dt l is equal to i omega alpha is equal to d omega by dt if you know these three formulas then this relationship will be very easy now let us see the relationship here we have to consider the following case so consider a rigid body of mass m this body is rotating in a circular path of radius r with angular velocity omega about the fixed axis now we know that the formula torque equal to dl by dt in place of l we have to write the formula of l i omega therefore tau equal to d by dt in place of l i omega so tau equal to i am writing before differentiation i d omega by dt so tau equal to i d omega by dt is nothing but alpha alpha so tau equal to i alpha is the relationship between torque and angular acceleration where i is moment of inertia of the object let us see one more question here define angular velocity and derive v is equal to r omega the meaning of angular velocity is rate of change of angular displacement when the object is in circular motion there will be a change in displacement with respect to time that is called as angular velocity definition rate of change of angular displacement is called as angular velocity second part is derive v is equal to r omega to derive this equation we should know the following formulas length of arc equal to radius into angle ds by dt is equal to v d theta by dt is equal to omega now let us derive v is equal to r omega consider an object is rotating on a circumference of a circle of radius small r initially the particle uh, at point a then afterwards it uh, moved to point b it is making angle theta therefore we have to use this first formula length of r equal to radius into angle so we will write here we know that length of r equal to radius into angle so length of arc if this is a complete circle so ab is an arc so length of arc is as here radius you can see from the figure r and angle is theta now differentiate a boy equation differentiate a boy equation so what we will get here ds by dt here r is constant d by dt of r theta so as r is constant we will take it uh, before the differentiation so ds by dt equal to r d theta by dt ds by dt is nothing but v r d theta by dt is omega now you can see that we have to got the formula v is equal to r omega 